Welcome to day five of the Career Reimagine Challenge. As always, we're going to start off with a look back at the ground that we've covered. You, my friend, have a lot to celebrate. This has been a lot of fun. But remember on Monday, we, bought, we brought you a paradigm shift from living to work to working to live. And then on Tuesday, we pushed the button, the reboot, to reboot your career operating system to realign with your passion and purpose. Wednesday, Wednesday was all about creating a life plan to bring harmony between career and personal life. Thursday, we outlined the pillars of your career, recognizing the non-negotiables, nice to have, and we gave ourselves permission to dream. Now today, we're gonna to wrap up our challenge with a conversation about what options exist in the workplace. During the planning so far, you may have discovered that your current role doesn't allow for your perfect role to exist within it. Now, what are you gonna do? So Mark has some great insight for us into current day career transition. Mark? Let's talk about the economy today. We're in the middle of two significant economic movements. First, we're facing the retirement of the baby boomers. Those born in 1957, the year with the peak birth rate of the baby boom, are now 65. And I venture to say that the majority are leaving the workforce or are being forced out of the workforce. This has changed the dynamic of the playing field from being an employer-based, employees exert control, to employee-based, where employees can be choosier or exert more control. And this has led to the great resignation. Now here are a few interesting stats that are influencing the great resignation that we're seeing happen around us. First of all, over 54 million Americans resigned between March 2021 and March 2022. The Great Resignation resulted in 11.54 million job openings in the U.S. in March 2022. Low pay was the leading reason for quitting a job in 2021. And most of those who switched jobs ended up in a better position than before. Where are these people going? Well, welcome to the gig economy. What is the gig economy? Well, it's, a it's a labor market characterized by the prevalence of short-term contracts or freelance work as opposed to permanent jobs. And what are the benefits of the gig economy? Well, primarily the gig economy provides workers, businesses, and consumers a more adaptable, adaptable structure, a flexible structure to meet the needs of the moment, which is a demand for more flexible lifestyles. Mm -hmm. The millennials, millennials, Easy millennials for you to say again. seem to be getting all the credit for the gig economy, and that's great. The truth is that it benefits everyone with experience or a unique skill set. The, the shift to specialized work has become even more viable as the baby boomers retire. We're seeing the emergence of a knowledge gap. Business owners need the skill sets and experience that we can offer, but do not have the budget to add full-time employees. Or employees with your level of skill and experience. Well, yeah, exactly. And with that background, let's go back to the career transition or career options. You basically have three. You know, the job mm -hmm. or consulting work or fractional services. And My we're favorite. We're going to discuss all of these. But Brendan, why don't you start out with the first one? Well, the first one that we'll talk about is the one that I think everybody's very familiar with, which is it's a nine to five. It's a job. A job is the career vehicle that many of us are most comfortable with. Your boss buys all of your time. You provide a service. You have one client and it's your boss. Now the pros, you know what you're going to be doing and where you're going to be every single day. There can be a feeling of security. Now the cons, you really don't have flexibility or choice of the work that you'll be doing. Your average job only lasts two to five years, so there's really no security. It's, so, so many people overlook that fact. Yeah, it's an illusion. Right. And you have all of your financial eggs in one basket, so to speak. Now for many, this can be the preferred career path. Unfortunately, as we gain experience, it's harder to find that perfect job. And some may even be bold enough to say that age discrimination exists. 
that may or may not be the case. Well, my son doesn't think it exists. Well, many millennials don't. <laughs> just just upgrade your, your skills, Dad. It's okay. Well, except when you go in for those job interviews and you're told that you're overqualified for the role. Well, that happens. Yeah. yeah. So they offer you what they can afford to pay, which is half of what you should be making. Yep. But it's also true that you will hear that companies prefer to promote from within versus hiring top leaders from outside of the organization. I think that's pretty true. I'm, I'm not going to argue with that. The next structure we're going to talk about is consulting work. Consulting work is where you or consulting group identify projects. They hire you to come in and fix the problem. That was often project. created by hiring somebody for half of what they could have. Oh, well, we don't want to yeah. go all okay. there. All right. We don't have time for all that. All right. Okay. <laughs> you, 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 Carry work, on. you work until the project's completed and you move on to the next consulting engagement. Um, there are pros. You get to work on a variety of interesting projects. And if you manage expectations right, and managing expectations is key, you can create a level of flexibility. Mm -hmm. And you often get paid very well for your expertise. Yep. The cons are you're always looking for that next consulting project. Right. Because they are finite jobs. Yep. And as these projects generally take most of your time, it's hard to find the next project. This leads to a gap in your income and in your life your lifestyle sort of becomes feast or famine. Which is not fun. And then the final structure we want to talk about, which as Brendan said, is our favorite, is fractional services. Mm -hmm. Fractional service providers can provide value on a part-time basis in all of these roles. The CEO, the CFO, VP of sales, sales manager, marketing director, CIO. Any of the O's. A lot of O's. IT director, no one in that. VP of Human Resources, General Counsel, and VP of Operations. There's an O. Chief Sales and Strategy. It just goes on and on. A special skill set or experience is what it's all about. Yeah. We have clients who offer fractional virtual assistance or sales services as well. Just about any job that accomplishes work through others can be a, comp be a fractional offering. And just like it sounds, a fractional service provider works a fraction of their time for multiple clients, providing high-level leadership at a fraction of the cost of a full-time employee. That's right. Pros, you avoid having all of your eggs in one basket as you're working for multiple clients. You have clients for long periods of time, so you're not always hustling for new work. You know, my clients are so dependent on me that I don't know if I could ever quit because I've built that relationship. I don't have to find that many new clients in my life. Well, but that's part of the reason you've also brought on team members to provide the level of support also, so yeah. that it's not just about selling your time for money, but we're gonna talk more about that on Saturday and Monday. <laughs> okay. Now, you also have the flexibility to add as many or as few clients as you would want. You're working on high level projects, that generally provide a very high value. You're, you're not balancing checkbooks, for example, Mark's favorite. Yeah, nobody wants to balance check. No one wants to pay you $300 on to balance your checkbook. So, you know, it sort of keeps you humble yeah. or in the right place. Now the cons, it can take time to develop a trusting relationship with a business owner. This is usually done by doing a consulting project or an organizational assessment to uncover the work that you would be doing. You will be responsible in many cases for cultivating your own work, which we feel is a benefit, but we're gonna to get to that in a minute. That's right. Now, by this time in our challenge, you've recognized what needs to shift and change for your career to drive the life you dream of. Now, we're not sharing this data to scare you, but more to inform the choices that you're gonna to make today and tomorrow. We believe that career security is a myth that sold the talented professionals by corporate America to keep you tethered. Call me cynical. I believe the game is rigged and your best chance of beating the house is to create your own rules rather than continuing to play by others. The post pandemic economy has provided companies a glimpse into what can be accomplished with remote work and alternatives to career or traditional career structures. From having your groceries delivered by Uber 
to turning your backyard playhouse into a home office. We're living in an entirely different world. Companies have now recognized they must adapt to the needs of the worker rather than having that my way or the highway approach that Mark and I have probably dealt with and you probably have as well. They also recognize the benefits of hiring upper level talent for the demands of the problems facing them. They realize they can't afford to hire a full-time employee with your talent and ability, but while they desperately need you, they don't need 100% of you. And they may not be able to afford 100% of you, but even a small business can find a budget to buy one-tenth of your time yeah. and ability. And due to the magic of technology, what used to take 20 hours can now take maybe only four. And business leaders are happy to pay you for results and the impact that you provide. Which we are going to talk about more tomorrow as well as Monday. That's true. Our hope is for you, for you this week is that you've recognized what your career needs to look like and, and in order to serve your needs, not just the needs of your employer. Now, the journey you began this week was designed to help you recognize where you are versus where you need to be. Now, the work begins to make that life, the life of your dreams, your reality. Now, let me tell you, the only path is, follow, is following the one that's planned for you by others. To create your dream job requires a lot of work and energy, and it's not without risk. But just like investments, often great risk precedes great reward. Now, we don't feel you're taking That's, great risks I you said that. by betting on you. Quite frankly, we believe that you are your only sure bet. If you are taking the fractional journey, we would like to serve as your coaches and mentors along the way. If you've enjoyed the conversation to this point and look forward to having a path laid out for you based on proven strategies that have built many successful and scalable fractional service businesses, join us for our next cohort of Freeway to Fractional. During this program, we'll show you the A to Z and beyond of building a fractional service practice. You will learn from our expensive mistakes at the University of Hard Knocks, We'll share what pitfalls and traps to avoid. We can't promise that you'll escape all of them, but our clients are sharing their results of months and even years shaved That's off right. of their ramp up to revenue. Now to participate in this program requires an additional investment. While it's not a large amount of money, we do ask for your commitment to the process. Our program is laid out over a five week delivery period with each week bringing questions and decisions for you to make and actions to take to not only build and sell your fractional service, but we take you beyond into scaling so that you're not always selling your time for money. We help you determine what structure makes the most sense for you and provide you with the interviews to assess partnership options to find the best fit for you. For many, you may have a dream of building a team of professionals. You want others to assist you with creating systems to scale. While some, you just enjoy the variety of work with clients that deeply appreciate you and pay you well. That's right. We're sharing a link in the message today for you to review the program. Tomorrow, we're gonna to be offering an additional bonus session that dives even more deeply into the fractional journey if you're on the fence and, and need a little more convincing. Tomorrow and Monday. And Monday. Now, if we had you at hello, as Jerry Maguire says, it's my favorite movie. We have shared the link in this message this AM for you to join us today. Now, during the Freeway to Fractional program, Mark and I show you how to create your fractional offering. We also show you how to build a good, better, and best level of service, with best providing a fractional service that's based on investment in impact, not trading time for dollars. Now the cost of Freeway to Fractional is $1,500 for a lifetime membership to the program. Now this is not your lifetime or mine, but the lifetime of the program. The programs delivered by SalesWorks are typically 10 to 15 years, with each year bringing an update that's included in your purchase, as well as access to a community of graduates. And we encourage you to return and repeat as your practice evolves and grows. 
who knows, you may find your next par partner in one of our future cohorts or a current cohort. Well, I, I do think these cohorts and these, 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 this community we're building is the magic of the program. It's well, very that's important. what they're sharing with us too. Amen. Let me also share something extra special. For an additional $500, we are providing a VIP level of participation. This is something that's new to us. Now in the VIP offering, we're gonna be hosting an additional working session. Now during the course, we provide examples and guides to create your own solution at a good, better, and best level. Now in our experience, we found incredible value in the collaboration with others. Some of our clients have even joined forces and formed partnerships based on these conversations. At the very least, you get a lot of ideas from what others are doing. Now this can be a magical discussion and we're going to host an additional two hour co-working session that is designed to create your perfect solution. This is the big bonus to the VIP level, but as Billy Mays would say, but wait, there's more. <laughs> The VIP level offer also includes additional group coaching weekly where we review questions, offer examples, and provide special guests who have really applied the lessons we're sharing that week in their own business. So kind of putting them on the hot seat so you can really get to know what worked and what didn't. Sometimes it can really help you to see it in action. So as we wrap down, I really, I want you to ask and be real with yourself. Do you hear a small voice way back in your head asking, could I be someplace better? Am I settling for less? Could I be happier? If so, you need to participate in Free Weight or Fractional. During our time together, we will provide you with the information that you need to make an informed decision. Once you're part of the Free Weight or Fractional family, you'll be supported by Brendan and I and our community. No matter what decision you make, stay in your job or find another job, we're your network. Go into consulting, we're your network. Decide to go into fractional, we're your network. We're here to help you accomplish the goal of creating the life you dream of. Let us guide and support you on your personal journey to fractional success. Now, if you're on the fence about deciding whether or not fractional mm -hmm. is right for you, Join us tomorrow for an in-depth look at what takes insiders years to learn about building a fractional service business. You can register in the invitation shared in our message this afternoon. Now, thank you so much for allowing us to support you in making key decisions this week. We are excited to see what you achieve. Can't wait to see you on the other side. We will see you tonight. Seven o'clock. Absolutely. We've got one more night. We're one wrapping night. up. Talk about all these options, answer your questions, and we've really enjoyed getting to know you. We might even bring a special guest or two for you to chat with about what their fractional service journey looks like. Wouldn't that be fun? All go. right. Thank you all very much. See you tonight.